Alright. Hello there. My name is Ron Chinwick here at Countryside Kennel. We got Irene Pick around over here. I've uh, been here for the last 25 years. She's working with the puppies. Denise Milan is doing the video. We're talking about a pretty special litter. Of course, I think they're all special. But as far as we were born on the 7th of the month, 21st day, 2018. Uh, they'll be nine weeks old. <laughs> Ninth month, which is this month, the 22nd, which is next week, uh, they'll be ready to go home. The dam is Ginger. Ginger is a direct daughter of a uh, touchdown guy. And also, uh, this is, uh, Elvis, he is his call name and real name E.T. Born Again. It's actually a direct son of Reverend Rouser E.T. That's who uh, Elvis is, a direct son of Reverend Rouser E.T. He's also the Hall of Fame. Uh, and he is a national champion too, right? Mm -hmm. Yep. Uh, and so that's quite an, an impeccable pedigree. I, I was working Ginger this year. She turned three, and I was working her this year, and then uh, she just done a heck of a job. The first time out, we went to a Durban Short Air Trial, which over 30 of us in there, and uh, she ended up winning that one the first time. She's going to get, what, two more points? She'll be done? Two more points for field champion, four more points for amateur field yeah, and champion. Like I said, she will finish in the bench in no time. She's absolutely beautiful. You can see some of the pictures we put with the book. But anyway, these girls are all spoken for, boys. correct? Boys. Boys. Oh, these boys. <laughs> these boys are all spoken for. So uh, but we want to go down through you and give you a little video. We, we microchip them. <laughs> they all males. We talk about white. We talk about body color, otherwise grade one, two, and three. And then we talk about the size they are, we talk about the tail, and then we talk about the energy level, which I think is probably the most important. Now this particular litter, uh, there's a couple of dogs in there that's got some, some energy now. And so be real careful, and, and you know, what I mean by that, when I say nine, 10, or something like that, you can bet your butt they're nine, 10. We don't get them very often. You can go back <laughs> on the video, but uh, you know, like I said, I, I normally take the high ones because <coughs> most of the time it comes down. I've got two females right now available actually because they were a higher energy and as they got a little bit older, then the energy level went down. That's normal because that's what we breed for. That's 80% of our clients. They don't want to fill trial dogs. They want something that's easier to mess with, etc. So look how pretty these little dogs are. Mm -hmm. All righty. But anyway, let's talk a little bit about this little red dog here. Mm -hmm. And this little red dog. Uh, we can see here we got a little bit of white on the chest. <laughs> okay, hold on. Yes, it's got a stripe on the chest. That's still a registrable mark. The AKC, nothing right. on the toes, nothing on the toes. Well, there's a little smidge on the on this side. That's it. There you go. Mm-hmm. But anyway, look, a little red dog here is is uh, again. He's got a little bit of white on the chest. He's got a body color. You can see how dark he is, as far as. The docile stripe, you can see how dark he is. Mm -hmm. And then you can see the size wise, he's one of the smaller of the four, uh, mm -hmm. which is fine. But like I said, real typey little dog. Uh, we would he, still he was, expect this, this litter to average the boys anywhere from 42 to 47 pounds as adults. <laughs> he's up this high, he's a man. I don't like that. I don't know about that, <laughs> but he's a pretty boy, pretty tail. All righty. Yeah. Energy level, I have this one here at eight to nine. Eight, nine energy level. I got it closer to the eight. Mm -hmm. okay. Very nice. Nice right. puppy. All right. Now okay, who's talk. second? I'm sorry? Who's next? Second will be the blue. Chip number 28, 25. I get it. 28, 25. So let's talk about the blue here. Yeah. Try okay. Okay, here we go. Sorry about the blue, blue in the film. <laughs> blue. Now, blue. Uh, we call him Tornado. <laughs> uh, he's a handful. And of course, I'm drew at the mouth about the handful. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I want something that's really uh, with a, a lot of energy in it to be independent. He is the alpha of the male, also. And so, look at that tail. Just a really a nice little dog all the way through. Uh -huh. uh, he's a three in color. Otherwise, uh, I'm sorry, get, I'm just talk about the white. He does have a little bit of white. On the chest, very little. Oh, where is it? Yeah, I lost it. Not really. There's a couple of hairs. No, I right guess there. not. That's it. And, uh, and that's I it. don't see anything on right, the No toes. white. Again, chip number 28, 25. He's three in body color. You can see how dark he is. Down through the dorsal stripe. 
On the side, sure. they kind of got puppy fuzz, so that's a little lighter, but that dark on the back is what they're going to be as adults. And he has got a three tail. Now, this is the energy level 9, 10. Uh, like I said, unless you want to run, I had a doctor one time call me up, and he said he wanted a 10 <laughs> energy level, and I, I was trying to really talk him out of it. I said, how often do you run? He says, eight miles a day. He runs over 20 miles on the weekends per day. <laughs> uh, I explained to him, he probably needed a 10. <laughs> but the energy level is important. Uh, Mm -hmm. and, and so many people worry about that energy level. You, you get this energy from, you know, some people just put them on a treadmill. Mm -hmm. uh, some people just go for walks. Uh, you know, these are active. We don't want to deny that. You know, they're healthy. Mm -hmm. That's what we breed for. We don't breed for, we breed for healthy, intelligent dogs. Which one? You know, all right, we're going to be going next on orange. All right. There we go. Sorry, I I'm swimming through the puppies. Sorry. <laughs> Shuffle right. them through puppies. Orange, oh baby. Oh baby. Alright, kind of let his let hind legs go out a little bit more. And, uh, there you go. Give him that bench. Oh, there is, there is that bench look. <laughs> yeah. You see all he said, hey. each other here. I'm not trained to that yet. <laughs> Got a natural tail, too. Come on, baby. Look at me. Alright, let's look at the, uh, <clears throat> the orange. It's 3277. It does have a little white on the foot, and it does have a little white on the chest. A real little. Yeah, that's very, here, very, and, uh, very small. A little and white on the toes. That's brighter in the camera than what it is actually to the eye. A little bit on the toes. Okay. All right, like I said here, he's uh, just a little bit on the, uh, actually he's one of the smaller ones. I'm sorry, body color. I'm sorry, 2.5 body color. Three is size on the bigger ones. Three on tail. Seven, eight energy level. I have this one here closer to the seven. Mm-hmm. Okay. All righty. Now we're going to be talking about gray. Gray. Right there. Uh, gray does have some white on him. Mm-hmm. Uh, his chip number is 7669. No, I'm sorry. He's, he's gray, got so the toy, nice. yeah. He's, yeah he's got how my dear the toy? <laughs> two is his gray. Uh, I mean, uh, gray's got ch uh, chest. He's got some white on the chest. And I've uh, got Robert going to set him up first. A little white on the toes. <laughs> Maybe I'll set him up. Actually, he's the lowest energy level we have in this group. They all go, I am not a bench dog. So you do have a little I white am. on the chest. Yeah, he does have little a little white on the toes, not much, but a little white on the toes. That does not go into Extremely the armpits, dark, so that though. means that's a legal white. Yep. Extremely him. dark on the, on the dorsal, both sides. You see how dark even the sides is dark on him? Mm. He's one of the smaller of the two. Mm. He is dark. He's got a three on tail, six, seven energy level. And actually, this is the lowest one I have in here, which is a six. Well, we have him with energy level of six. Face, sorry. Oh, but all these are really nice puppies. And so, uh, uh, if you got any questions, please give us a ring. But again, these are Ginger and Albus. And Ginger's two points away from being a field champion. Mm -hmm. And once we get a field champion on, she'll make it uh, a best champion, I'm sure. Okay. We're going like to let run down the hall a little bit. We'll show you how they participate in the play. They, this is the first time they ever see this toy, so this is totally different. But you'll notice that they want to all jump in and start into the play, want to want to participate with, with Irene. And you'll notice the ones that are first are those top ten levels that Rod <laughs> Dell was talking about, the energy level. The other ones come back a little bit quieter. They still play but not quite so brave as as the uh, more dominant ones, as you can see. There they go. Go ahead, take a seat, Irene. And like I said, these ratings are, are from what we're seeing today. They are from what we've been looking at for two whole weeks. Here, guys. And puppy, Irene's going to call them. There they come. They love that come call. Come here, boys. Grab that guy. Puppy, puppy, puppy. Mm -hmm. come here, there he is. There he is. And they all love to, you know, even though they have energy or don't have energy or quieter, they all want to get in the lap. But you'll notice the ones that want to get in the lap first are those with the lower energy. <laughs> There's orange on the outside saying, oh, I love you too, I love you too. But anyway, that gives you a little idea of what they're at. Please call us. Give us all your questions. And each one is individual. Each one's really sweet and loving. This is, this is the smiley bloodline and the Elvis lap dog bloodline. So uh, these guys are enjoying the home, but an absolute fun in the field for playing for running. Nice dogs. Thanks for watching our film.